Blueberries. All right, right off the bat, you've got syncopation. And the bass note comes a little after the melody there. For what that's worth. And um, a little bit of walking bass. So this piece, basically the form goes four times through. And the first time through, uh, the first and second time, the first time through the melody, the second time through the melody is essentially the same as the first, but the difference is the left hand. So in the first time through, after the four bar introduction, the left hand is kind of a mixture of rhythms. bit of walking bass at the end of the phrase but it's not totally walking in four whereas the second time through we get a little more walking a little more active bass line it's still a little bit of a mixture between a two feel or a half note pulse and the quarter note walking pulse then in the written out solo which is the third time through the form the bass begins to walk in earnest Listen to recordings of jazz walking bass, and that'll give you the style and the way that should sound and feel in the left hand. Now, the improvised solo, you can play anything you want. It's improvised. Uh, the um, figures in the left hand are given as a guide, but even you can change that if you like. Just adhere to the 12 bar form and the chords the chord structure, that's the most important thing. So, starting at bar 41. If I'm soloing, it might be hard to keep those rhythms going like that. In fact, I think in my demonstration, I did not. Uh, my left hand veered away from what's written here. That's okay. Um, that's not exactly what I did, but it's different every time. Um, and uh, just a note about what the left hand is playing. Just the tritones, the, the, the main tones of the chord. So for the F7, we have the 7th and 3rd, moving to the 3rd and 7th of the B flat 7. And this is standard. If you're going to only have two notes of a dominant chord, those are the two that you want to have to outline or delineate the, the chord quality. Um, we'll do more on improvisation in a separate video. And then the last time through, well, the melody goes into the left hand. And the chord's in the right hand. So you want to bring out the left hand. This is at bar 53. Last little bit. Well, in that bar, the fourth bar, uh, the left hand is just holding up and doing nothing, so that right hand takes an opportunity to sort of answer. And um, this whole kind of a dialogue that can happen between parts is a characteristic of the style. So it's kind of like this is going to an E. Yeah, it's a conversation about going to the E flat. What else, what else is there to talk about? All right, and um, finishes off with the last four bars. Melody comes back into the right hand. It's a variation. All right, with a walking bass in the left hand. And of course, we end on a nice syncopated 
chord, it's an and of four upbeat. If I had done it on four, it would sound like this. Um, there are many more things one can talk about, but that's probably all we need for blueberries. And thank you for watching.